Welcome back, guys. We have trucks on their way up to get um, crude here. We have quite a lot of crude sitting here because the trucks have been on, a way, on their way for a while from all the way over here in Gdansk. And they had to go all the way down through Warsaw to get over here. So let's see what it says our rate is on this. 791. That's not good enough. Um, let's get 11 more vehicles on here. Clone those. Okay. Now we have a line, of course, going from up here down to Riga East and dropping off uh, crude so that we can make uh, oil down here. Then we have a line down here going... Uh, that needs a lot more vehicles as well. But it basically goes up to the fuel refiner here and then to the harbor and back again. And I put a little waypoint in here uh, for the return trip because it wanted to go through the yard. I don't want it to do that. Uh, but we definitely need more uh, vehicles on this. We need a rate of 800. Um, so I think we need probably eight more vehicles on here. Or something like that. We actually need a rate of 1600 on this. So this is not enough. Um, we need at least six more vehicles on here. Maybe. But it should start making money very soon this line because there are a lot of uh, full trucks coming down and of course these need to upgrade but they will uh, then of course we have a shipping line which has a rate of 1325 which is way too much uh, we can probably take Four ships off that. Uh, 972. That's okay. And they are sail going to be sailing the fuel over here to Hamburg North. Uh, which it's not going to be called, it's going to be called Hamburg Port. Mm -hmm. And then we have a truck line here, which is going to be taking it down to Berlin. And then our train can pick it up and take it over here and do whatever needs to be done but we need to up this as well a bit so almost double let's get six more on there and see how that looks okay and all of this is being done to, to make our uh, train here uh, not that one um, this train profitable that's all it's for is to make this train profitable that's basically it because what we're working on is getting our lines to be profitable so yeah now over here i saw that our lines here they actually don't have a high enough rate so i think we need to manage these vehicles 
and replace them with something else. Like, uh, I don't like these because they only carry 25. We have vehicles that carry more. So we have these guys that carry coal. So what do these, how much do these carry now? 21. And so this will, I think, uh, take them up to the point where they're making money. Or where their rate is high enough. It's more than high enough. Okay. So we can probably take... So we need a rate of 1,600. We can probably dispose of four vehicles or something. That is perfect. That is perfect. And it's the same with the steel. Um, let's can you manage vehicles or with the iron ore. And I think we'll get rid of four of these before we replace with these guys. And that gives us a very, very hard rate. Uh, so we can probably take four more off. 1,742, two more off. That's a little bit, that was too much. So clone that one. Okay, so that again means fewer vehicles on the roads, which is a good thing. And, all right, uh, it's close, but it, it's, Good enough. So hopefully we'll be producing more down here because we're we're running out of steel down here all the time. That's why we're not producing at a max. And we want to be producing at max. Okay. Uh, you are pretty much producing at max. You have some stored. We have more coming in here. So that's all good. New buses. And new planes and new trains. New buses, planes and trains. A lot. Wow. Okay. Alright, so are you getting ready to go up? I hope so. Uh, you are producing now. You have a lot stored. You need to produce more. Produce more. Okay. Now, what I want to do over here is ensure that this line here, uh, manage line, so, in Amsterdam and Rotterdam North, you can actually load fuel as well. And in Brussels Northwest, you can unload fuel as well. Because then we'll get more fuel going over to London as well, and London needs more fuel. And Amsterdam will get more fuel. Uh, so what we could actually do is edit that line a bit. Uh, so that after Amsterdam, we go to Victoria Street again. 
Though I'd like it to be on the other side. So we'll do a unloading thing there as well. And we'll tell Okay, that's perfect. So so now if we look at this line, it's going like that. And that is great. But we need to see uh fuel so we want fuel here it does seem like it wants all the fuel down there pretty much so that's good that's good okay so that gives us some more demand and that is exactly what we want Beautiful. Be a beautiful. And down here, we have a lot sitting here on the Berlin fuel supplies. Uh, we have weirdly this stuff sitting here as well. So, um, manage line. And at Berlin sightings, you can load fuel. And that's it. Yeah. So I hope that stuff will start going away and go over to basically the good supplies. Um, and I think... What's the rate on this? 109... Where are you going exactly? Um, you're going down to North Street there. If we take a look, this is kind of where they want fuel, but they will definitely want fuel down here as well. So let's put a stop in. Here. And we'll end that. And after North Street, you go there as well. Good. And I think we'll update the vehicles because they are... Uh, no, that's not it. Is it this one? No, oh, that's good. What's, what's your rate? 173. That's probably fine. Uh, we want to manage these vehicles. And we want to replace them. With... These tankers, I think. And that'll certainly mean that has a higher rate which means that we can get rid of one of them I think okay you're coming in with 119 fuel well that's better than it was before how much does that net you 2.5 million so it's actually making money right now but it won't in the long run unless we get this going uh, which we are getting going excuse me got something caught in my throat uh, you are producing a little bit now so that's good Uh, just need you to go up. Um, seventeen and seventy. That's definitely enough. So we just need you to go up. Increase your production. You too. It's 
the shipment that's the problem right now, it seems like. Uh, you don't really have 824, which is fine. And our ships have a rate of 883, which is fine. So it should just be a matter of time before this uh, starts increasing. You should have a lot of consumers. Well, actually not that much. London, Glasgow. What's Glasgow a consumer? Okay. Berlin, nine, Brussels, Amsterdam. It is climbing some, but not that fast. We need more consumers. But I think it will be good enough. I think it will be good enough. Uh, I suppose this rate now could need to go back up. So if we manage vehicles and we put, let's say, three more on there, that's probably okay. Demand is climbing for all of them. Well, mostly. All right, more the new streetcars, new trains. Okay, well, while we give that a bit of time, this is still really not making money, which is very frustrating. And Berlin machinery is not Liverpool coal to steel. Kinda is. Berlin machinery. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, basically, it's over here. Uh, let's pin you. So you have a rate of 509. Which is... Honestly, probably fine, because Frankfurt wants 257. Yeah. It's kind of fine. Uh, we have 52 sitting here. Okay, you're picking up now. What's the rate on you? 981. That's enough. That's enough. Okay. Uh, we are getting a lot sitting here, but there's a truck picking up again, and here comes another one to pick up, and another one, and another one. So I think it's all good. We should be producing enough steel now to feed you, so that your production goes up. Which is exactly what we want. Alright. Germany, Latvia, Express, sometimes losing. This is sometimes losing, but most of the time they're making money. In the long run, on the, in the long term, they're making money. You're actually full on the machinery now, which is great. So, you should uh, start making money. Yeah. Yeah, so now it's making money. This is making less of a loss now, which is good. Shipping lines. We have a few that are not making money. 
which is very annoying. The Stockholm Gdansk ferry is fair enough. It has 65 people on board. It will make money. Barcelona tools, though. To Marseille. Why? Oh, you have 173 on board. You just made 892,000, so... You are making some money. We have 96 tools sitting over here. Uh, so, yeah. It's probably fine. Madrid Solid Supplies definitely needs an upgrade on its vehicles. So, let's do that. Um, you can carry 12. Uh, let's replace you. Let's actually... Why can't I replace... Oh, no, I can. Weird. Um, all cargo. Replace. There we go. That'll give it a bit of a boost. And that's good. This train is making money as well. Uh, yeah, it's making money. What's the rate on it? 489, that's not a lot. We actually need higher rate on this. Because... Yeah. I think I want to replace these trains. Uh, replace we want uh, electric Siemens yeah I think that's fine it's USA Italy well let's go with uh, Italy uh, let's Add that, and then cargo. We want these box cars. Um, let's give them a capacity of that. Uh, how long was that train? Can't see that, can we? Uh, 253 meters this station is that 240 or what is it no they're 320 okay, what's the rate on this now 679 that's better that's better now over here we are up to a production of 500, so that's good. Uh, you have a rate of 705, that's fine. You have a rate of 630, that's fine. And how much food do we have sitting here? 18. Uh, you're bringing in 13. What's your rate? 296. Probably okay. What's the rate up to Paris? Uh, 152, and we have a lot of food sitting there. Um, I actually think... actually think we want to... Get this rate up a little bit. Let's put two more trucks on it. Yeah. That seems good to me. Because we weren't transporting enough for this to grow anymore. This should do it. 
Where are all of these trucks though? There's one there. There's one coming back there. One there delivering. I think. I think I'll just clone one here. And put on there. Okay. So. We got to. Yeah, that makes sense that that's making money or losing money because it's not up yet. But this line, which is not where I keep clicking on the wrong dang thing. Um, why are you not making money? So it's plastic to London. Uh, you are only producing 600. Why? Because you're not getting enough crude. 99. What's your rate? 1435. That's definitely enough. Well, actually, it's not. Because we need it to be 1600. Because it's crude to oil's plastic. So we need a couple more ships on here. Mm. A new ferry, nice. And a lot of new trains. I like it. We're in 2009 now. Uh, okay, so it's this line that I actually want to open. 1639, that's perfect. Perfect rate. Or is it? So this is coming from up here and you can't produce 1600. You can only produce 1200. So that's where our problem lies, isn't it? That is definitely where the problem lies. We, we're not getting enough crude down here. We are not getting enough crude down here. So what do we do about that? Uh, it does mean that we didn't need to add these two uh, ships. So take that back down and we can actually take it down some more. And even more, I think. Yeah, that's perfect. Uh, alright, I don't need you. So here... Put ships some more from here. What's your rate? 1344, so no. We are transporting everything. Uh, and over here we're... Transporting everything as well. So we could dip some crude down from here. You know what? Let's do that. Um, before we do this, let's just. Upgrade these streets. Okay. Let's get you in there. We already have truck stops here. So that's fine. So, uh, new line from there to there. Uh, no. Uh, there and this will be Aberdeen uh, Rude to 
Glasgow Port. And the reason I called it Aberdeen is because it's called Aberdeen Oil. Alright. Now here we need to tell this that in Glasgow Port yeah, you're not allowed to load anything good. So then we need a new line. It doesn't need to be that. Uh, that doesn't need to have the highest frequency, but uh, so we'll call this Glasgow. Food uh, to the lava oil. Uh, it doesn't need to have a, uh, that higher rate. Uh, so, uh, buy vehicles. Uh, we'll buy the Viola. We'll buy six of them. That's probably enough. And the color was this dark blue thing. Uh, so, let's go crew to Le Havre oil. And then we need to buy some road vehicles. Buy vehicles. And I think we'll get, what, six trucks? Set you on Aberdeen through Glasgow. Those were tankers, right? That I bought. Yeah. All right. And then we need to tell that line to in Le Havre port. Don't load anything. And up here, just load crude. And basically don't unload anything. Okay. So you are producing. Good, good. What's the rate on uh, our new shipping line here? 559, that's perfect. That's perfect. Um, what's your rate? 660. We can probably sell one of you. Yeah, that's fine. All right. And how are we looking over here? Have we leveled up yet? No. No. Uh, consumers. 56, 27, 13, 3, 1. Hmm. It's not as much demand as I would like. Berlin should have a lot more demand, I, I feel like. And so should London. Because we can now. I mean, this line is allowed to load and unload there. Uh, you're allowed to unload there. You're allowed to load and unload there. And you're allowed to unload there. So why don't we have more demand? Is it because London... I mean, London has a lot more demand for oil. So let's take a look of a fuel. So... It wants fuel down in 
this area, but also up in this area, and that's the problem. So we need to put a truck stop up here for this line. Right now it's going over there. We need to go over there, and I think we need to go down here. So let's put in a couple of drop-off spots. I think we'll put one in there. And then we'll put one in here. And we will, in this, manage the line. Uh, after London Halt, go there. Then go to Victoria Road. Then go up here. And... I suppose that's it. Then we need to manage the vehicles. And we'll replace them with... Uh, some man tankers. Yeah, why not? Um, replace. Oh, uh, wrong button. Wrong button. I do that a lot. I know, I'm sorry. Alright, so that's that. And then I think we'll clone one. Three hundred and one. That's close to perfect. That should up the demand for London over here soon. And that's good. That's very, very good. Uh, what about Glasgow? Uh, let's uh, pin you. Basically, all your fuel demands are up here, so you're fine. You're absolutely fine. Oh, here comes our first tanker picking up, I think. Yeah. And we have 133 sitting there for it, which is fine. This is good. This is good. All right, are you starting to be an increase in consumers for London? No. Damn it. Why not? Um, we do have some fuel sitting here. Well, that's something. That's something. It might be that this train's rate has a rate of 407. Might actually need to increase that. Though I feel like Berlin should want a lot of this fuel. What's our rate here? 201. And you want 389. So. How about we own one of these again? And possibly again. That's a little bit too high, but that's okay. Okay, so this really should get the demand going up. It really, really should. Uh, London is climbing a little bit now. It's not a whole lot though. Yeah, that'll be fine and that'll be fine. Uh, this will be fine too. Back to the trains. 
Iberian cargo distribution. It's losing a lot of money. A lot, a lot of money. We might have a bit too high of a rate on this now. Uh, the Barcelona tools to Bordeaux is getting better, though. But Iberian cargo distribution. Damn. What's your rate? 834. Yeah, that's too much. Um, sell you. Hopefully that'll help that a bit. Tram lines. Doesn't seem that upping the frequency on some of them helped anything. I mean, they're not made to make money, really. They're made to get people's lines that do make money. But it would be nice if they did make money. Um, how many vehicles do we have on here? Probably one too many. Uh, and the same here. Oh. All right. So, uh, frequency of three minutes is fine. Uh, Brussels tram one. How many vehicles do we have on this? Uh, four. Sell one of those. Uh, and Brussels tram, we can. Definitely sell one as well. We can sell two, I think. We can sell one more on this one as well. Okay. And then... Berlin tram. Frequency of seven minutes don't think there's anything we can really do about this. Hamburg fuels of Berlin, yeah. These are understandable. Now these, we don't need this line because um, up here uh, these guys can actually pick up. So they're bringing in 30 uh, machinery here and they're gonna pick up planks so and your rate is 900 which is enough so this line can actually go away um, Okay. Well, that's one way of removing lines that don't make money. Uh, London fuel supplies, you will make money, I think. Once you get, start getting more fuel. Bordeaux food, food to transport. Why are you not making money yet? I mean... You are producing 600, well, 500. Oh, you're about to go up. You are maxed. And you're about to be maxed. So that's good. You have a rate of 622, which is fine. You have a rate of 700, which is fine. It's actually a little bit too high. Uh, so let's uh, sell you. And see what your rate is then. A lot of new buses. A lot of new buses. A lot, a lot of new buses. And some new trains. Alright. Uh, so now you have a rate of exactly 600. Which makes me a little bit nervous. So 
Let's put one more on there. Rather one too many than one too few. And this should mean that you get up to make producing 600. Which is good. Because now you're almost there. And we're shipping everything, which is great. The consumers, we have a lot. In Paris, Madrid, Barcelona, Bordeaux, Seville, Lisbon. That's great. That's actually great. Because this should mean that our train line here will start making money. We only have a rate of 222, but that's enough right now. More than enough. Uh, 32 tools on board. Need more. Uh, where is the ship? Uh, that ship. Uh, that is making money now. Yeah. That line's making money. Good. So we, we really, really should start making a lot more money. We really should. Uh, Paris probably wants fuel as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so where, where does Paris want fuel? Over in this area. So what if we put a drop off? Something like here we put a truck stop in um, 10 buildings will be removed uh, we really just need one platform right now anyway we'll put you in there we will set up a new line going from oh uh, it'll be called line one from there to the, uh, no oh yes <clears throat> and this will be Paris fuel deliveries okay and then let's see what do we have sitting here a lot of bricks Um, we're going to manage this vehicle. It's a very old train. We're going to replace it with obviously something electric. Like you. And then we'll put some boxcars on there. And we'll put some tank cars on there. And we'll replace you. Uh huh. No electric path. Well, you are electric. What's not electrified? You? Yep. You. All right. So we are over time. So I think I will get this done in between episodes so that we can actually bring fuel over this way and down to Paris in order to get all of this going uh, more. <clears throat>
more uh, efficiently, you might say. Because right now, we're not really getting enough. So what what are you producing right now? 100 and... Yeah. So we, we, we need more production. We, we just need more production. And that's fine. That's fine. Or we need more demand. And we can get that. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. Uh, and I'll do that in between episodes, set that up so that it's ready for next time. So, um, yeah, next episode is the final episode. Uh, will we get all our lines making money? No, definitely not. Uh, but I feel like we've done a lot to make them make money. And the beer and cargo distribution is looking better. Barcelona tools to Bordeaux is looking much better as well. So I think we're on the right path, uh, right path to to get these uh, all our train lines at least making money, and pretty much all our shipping lines as well. I'd say. So yeah, so yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.